Good day, fellas. I hope you are ready for your daily dose of skill. And today we are going to play with Object 704. I noticed that the last time we had a video with this vehicle like one and a half year ago or something. And I'm trying to um, refresh my knowledge and in a way refresh the videos of the tanks we haven't played in a very, very, very long time. So currently I'm pretty much uh, doing a list to myself what to deal with, what kind of tanks review. There is going to be a lot of a lot of outdated tanks overall, some tier 8s, some tier 8 premiums, some tier 9s and so on, so on, right? Plus on top of that, I really want to uh, tell you one thing that... Mm. What a beautiful tank. That um, we are working on relating every single tank in index page. So if you want to see quite a bit of the variety uh, and you want to see how the live stream is looking like today, we are going to do that. And it's going to be uh, quite a journey to say that the least, right? A lot of variety. Uh, I will try to remember the things. I will try to ask uh, uh, your opinion. What do you think about one or another um, uh, one or another tank in a way, right? So, I believe this is going to be entertaining to watch as a viewer, and it's going to be entertaining for me as a streamer as well. Anyways, uh, that being said, this tank, in my opinion, is beautiful, okay? I don't see any problems about this um, mother trucker whatsoever. The main reason being, why am I saying so? Because this tank is pretty much perfect where triangle goes. Sure thing, you do not really have a turret, that is hashtag never lucky, right? No turret. Oh well, what can you do? But other than that, you have everything what you could ever need, at least in my humble opinion. Uh, that being said, 750 alpha damage. Pretty good gun handling for this alpha damage. Extremely awesome penetration, 286. You pretty much do not need a gold whatsoever for that, right? Uh, if you would make a decision to load the gold, you have... Um... I'm trying to figure out do I want to be aggressive and no I don't. Um, I will play this game safe and I think this is going to be a better option. Anyways, if you will make a decision to load the gold, um, 329 millimeters of penetration could be actually could be actually better, but it is how it is. Uh, and uh, penetration with a high explosives 90 millimeters, so you can send light tanks to the garage without even asking uh, uh, their name. Now, mobility-wise, this tank isn't perfect, obviously, right? But to be completely honest with you, I mean, whenever you are playing with a um, sniper schnitzel tank destroyers, right? Uh, you are not thinking about <coughs> being the quickest mother trucker on the field, if that makes sense, right? At least I do not look into the triangles in this way. Okay, we are ready. I can see the CLC. Watch this. Uh, have a lovely day, sir. Enjoy yourself and have a blast, buddy. Good. This is exactly what we want to see. Now, we are going to return to the same position where we played before. And this time we will try to spank this Conqueror or alternatively T-55. But I think Conqueror is the one who is asking to be spanked. Unfortunately... I missed the shot. But to be fair with you, that wasn't well aimed by any shape or any form. Meanwhile... Oh, yes. Hi there. Enjoying yourself there. I mean, look how beautiful is this mother tracker. I really like alpha damage of this tank. And uh, one more thing to say, which is super important. I think... I'm not entirely sure, but I think this tank was one of the first tanks I got uh, uh, 10 kills or 10,000 damage. I cannot uh, recall it uh, exactly, but I think this tank is having um, a special place in my heart as well, right? Okay. Ooh, big boy. Okay. Okay. You know you will return to the same position. 
I know you will return to the same position and today you are going to get a cheaper shell. Shell, today you are going to get 950 in the face just because of the special discount for your lack of armor. Let's see. I have a feeling he should sit here though. Mm, no. So, do I want to go for a blind shot? I think I do. A good gun handling skill. Good gun handling, eating everything. The awesome tank knight skill. Oh. Mm. <laughs> minus 900. Casual minus 900. And now we are booming and now we are playing. I am looking towards Bizo. Doesn't really matter what I'm looking at. If I would get um, a chance to make one more shot, I would be super happy. Although... Haha! <laughs> <laughs> good, very good. Meanwhile, only Arta left, and to be completely honest with you, I don't really care about this Arta that much. You know what? What is the chance that this Arta is sitting somewhere here and he relocated? I know it sounds crazy, but some Artas have a keyboards, okay? It happens very, very rarely, but sometimes... But sometimes it does mean well. ELC is saying, PP is raised, King alive. Three, two, one. No, not really. It's okay. You see, Arta with a keyboard. This is very unusual. You are not seeing this often. I can tell you that. And at this point, kaboom. I thought he is going to dance. Honestly, fellas, I thought he is about to uh, put his uh, cha 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 moves uh, from the sleeve and he is going to um, show some dominance against us on the dance floor. But I am wrong. I mean, Arta with a keyboard, that is already um, pretty impressive, if you know. Okay, first battle was pretty nice. And I am really curious did I, res did I have 10 kills with this tank or, or 10,000 damage? Because in my my brain I had a blank for a moment so we will check it out meanwhile 4.6 thousand damage 500 assisting damage three kills beautiful game the first uh, uh, class as well thank you very much I appreciate you object you are treating me well as usual thank you thank you thank you and all and all fellas uh, we made 81,000 profits so that was uh, very very good and i'm super happy about this now going deeper okay 10,000 damage sorry not 10 kills 10,000 damage I, I remember something with a 10 so yeah like i said uh this tank has uh, quite a special place in my heart because of that as well anyways round number two shall we i believe we will uh, keep going strong well hopefully Oh, beautiful Karelia, fellas. Assault. I really love Kale uh, Karelia Assault, to be fair with you. I truly enjoy it, and for me, it is significantly better than the standard game mode, if I can say so. And I think Variet is very, very nice overall to have a choice. Do you want to play everything? Do you want to play only standards? Do you want to play offense, defense, whatever? I think choice is very, very nice. Anyways, what we are going to do, we are going to take this typical bush here. And if the things will go well, we might get 5,000 plus in this game without bigger problems whatsoever. Now, a lot of things are depending how enemies are going to play this game and what kind of actions enemies are going to do, right? That is quite straightforward. So at this point, we are just chilling and we are just waiting. Meanwhile, oh, Lansen. Oh, you sneaky bugger. Oh, you sneaky bugger. Okay, so what am I thinking? I'm thinking about blind shooting here. 
That's what I am thinking. Ooh, a lot of blind shots, fellas. And that's what I call impressive. And that's what I call impressive, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Truly. Very, very, very strong. First minute of the game, instantly blind shots left, blind, uh, blind shots uh, right. I mean, that's very, very good, honestly. That is very good. Okay. We are just chilling at this point. There is no need for us to cock our pants. We are feeling very, 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 very well with all of this. Now, obviously, the most ideal case scenario would be to see this convoy sitting somewhere here, right? Because I assume they have a convoy. And we are just simply waiting. No, there is no chance I'm spotted. There is no chance I am spotted, fellas. Or oh, ELC is saying... Du -du 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 and he is definitely going to spot someone for us. Oh, MTV. You sneaky, magnificent fella. Nice. MTV is dead. That is very, very good. And at this point, fellas, we are ready to go. At this point, we are ready to shoot whoever is going to get spotted here. But I have a feeling that... Oh, Lansen. Someone took a blind shot before, right? Unfortunate, mate. Unfortunate. That was an insta-karma. Imagine that. You are blind shooting someone and someone is saying, Oh, I'm getting blind shooted. Schnei to the face. That is definitely an instant karma. Okay, Rashem is sitting uh, here. Hori is sitting right there around the corner. That is completely fine. We cannot cry about this. In fact, we are feeling very, very great. Meanwhile, Ergashem, aim, 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 aim. Bam. First visible shot. You see, the gun handling of this tank is truly uh, magnificent. You can actually hit shots without bigger problems whatsoever with this tank. Right? Don't you think so? And this is what you need. Whenever you are playing with a triangle without gun... Uh, this is a problem. And in this situation, I can't trust this gun. What the flying F is happening here? No, he's sitting right there. Every single mother trucker is going uh, blind shots on me. Fellas, I I am going to report them for, unsmor for unsportsmanlike conduct. That is outrageous. Hmm. I don't really mind and I do not really care. <laughs> <coughs> I don't really mind and I do not really care about this. I just I just need to have my eyes widely open and I need to start spanking enemies whenever they are doing something silly. I mean, I'm telling you, it's insanity. Enemy team is doing such a great job, you know? You know, some people are calling me um, blind shoot master and whatnot, right? Uh, and I must tell you, fellas, enemies, enemies are not giving up. They are spanking the same position like there is no tomorrow, and they are definitely giving me um, a hard time, right? And I'm not saying that is wrong. I'm saying that is pretty good. By the way, have I mentioned uh, this tank is um, from USSR? And that being said, uh, this vehicle has quite a trollish armor, and trollish armor is all the time good if you you know what I mean. Okay. If I need to guess where the convoy is sitting at, I would try to guess he is sitting uh, here. I am wrong. I need to relocate. There is nothing what I can do at this point. At this point, there is nothing what I can do. The thing is, making pressure here, it is going to be extremely, extremely hard. And that is a fact. Maybe I could take this position. Yeah, let's try to be the living crap out of the guys who are playing aggressively. Okay, he's playing hold down. That is a problem. Now, hold down play from 277, obviously it is expected. But... Um, 
To deal with this, it is going to be extremely hard. Okay, excellent. He's down. Very good, very good, very good. Now we are going to make pressure towards Bizonte and towards Leo. And we should be all right, fellas. I mean, this is, in a way, three versus three fight. But soon we are going to uh, make it happen two versus one. Since Bizonte is down to fartable and down to one shotable, I think we can, we can make pressure. I believe so. No, let's see. Bizonte is what I'm looking for. Yep. 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 Nine to the garage. Excellent. And now all we need to do, we need to eliminate this Progetto from the game. I kind of think he's sitting somewhere here. That would be my guess. Okay. But soon we will figure this out. Am I right or am I wrong? Oh, I'm reading you like open book. Or you are my booklet, my man. You are my booklet. Very, very nice. Hopefully I won't take another one for the team from the Esterva. At least that's what I am hoping for. Good. And how we can approach the enemies at this point. Oh, this is a hard game. Oh, this is a hard game, fellas. I think I will try to take this position here. So hopefully we can get uh, some assisting damage or alternatively we can spot for ourselves. Because I do not really think there is any other option for me to do the things. You know, there is two minutes on the timer left. Two bloody minutes, fellas. And two minutes is not a lot of time. Okay, if my calculations are correct, he is going to move right about now. My calculations are wrong, or predictions, I suppose to say. All we have, we have two minutes on the, on the clock. I want to do, I want to get an extra shot here. I think we are capable of doing that. I think we are definitely capable of doing that, fellas. What would you say? You... No! That was overmatch angle! Oh, you son of the banana. That was overmatch angle. Really? Really? How you can even bounce, Esterva? I feel violated. Boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, I definitely feel violated. Well... What can you do? Sometimes you need to accept your responsibility and sometimes you need to say, fine, fair enough. Um, we hit only one blind shot, so we should have 4.1 thousand damage and 200 assisting damage. Uh, this is my prediction about this game. It was very, very hard. The enemies did not give us a single second to um, calm down and to chill, you know? All the time blind shots from the enemy side, which is very fair played, and that was a good one. Uh, after that, we had uh, uh, we pretty much lost completely at their, the other side, uh, and we actually haven't won the side where we played. So uh, it was just simply very, very, very hard game. But I'm okay with that. Meanwhile. What do we have? We have 4.1 thousand damage, 200 assisting damage. I am feeling pretty okay with this, although obviously we finished everything with a defeat, which is quite sad. Centurion, GG. This guy played like, um, like a king. He hold that, um, the side without bigger problems whatsoever, pretty much by himself. Right? Ooh, a lot of blind shots by the convoys. A lot of blind shots for sure. Anyways, uh, we made 6,000 credits. So far, our session is going well. We are playing for over 4,000 and I'm feeling great with this. Let's go. One more 4,000 in skills. 100% happy. Let's do this. Lakeville, Lakeville, Lakeville. This is going to be a complicated one. Okay. Uh, I have a feeling this is going to be straightforward. We are going to go in the city. I don't feel like I want to snipe. I don't feel like I want to play in one two line. I simply do not see why would I do that. And um, I think the best option for us is to go and take this. So yeah, yeah, lemming train. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm seeing how many people do we have playing here, and at this point, I am, uh, I am. 
questioning my life choices is it the right way to play the game does it make sense fellas um i am just let's say paranoid i don't feel like this is the right play meanwhile they have t49 where is this t49 sitting at let's go for a typical bush somewhere over there i haven't seen the splash have you i haven't seen the splash fellas I would not act surprised if this T49 is simply sitting in this typical bush and he is uh, enjoying himself to the maximum, right? And now we could clearly see the splash. So I think there is a tiny chance we hit this T49. Okay, let's go for another one. You know, we have all time in the world of tanks. We are okay. So I am taking a bit different approach in this situation. I am actually playing safe is it worth it well the time will show everything i know one thing i have no business doing in one two line uh without turret without gun depression i am going to be a snack for enemies so this is not what i'm looking for simple as simple as this but what we can do we can say hello for cobra mm. Minus 700. I'm telling you, the gun handling of this tank is so good. So good. It is so good. Cobra. I'm trying to speak his uh, language uh, to get out of the shadows, but... Doesn't look like we are going to be able to do this, huh? Going for another blind shot. Unfortunately, I am not hitting anyone. Whoop. I'm done. Fine. Join me. Ibiar, Ibiar tried to do his, uh, his best while... Okay. Ibiar was trying to do his best while going like crazy mother trucker left, right and center. Right, but... In the end of the day, he lost a lot of hit points, and there is nothing what he can change about this. Mm -hmm. What is the correct play, fellas? Let me think. What is the correct play? I kind of could join our guys making pressure like this, because honestly... It looks like um, our team has a humongous advantage here, right? And when it looks like it, probably it is the case. So let's do this. Ah, T49. You took one for the team. You took one for the team. I can see he was missing like 700 hit points. And I think... Uh, uh, and I want to believe this is thanks to us, fellas. Meanwhile. At this point, do I want to be more aggressive? Yes, I think I do. I think I want to be even more aggressive. And I think, in fact, I'm going to take either this position or either this position. Not entirely sure yet. Uh, since EBR is going in front like crazy mother trucker, I will instantly go here on the corner. And I hope we are going to be able to see the Fava sitting in the back, you know? That's what I am uh, hoping for. No Fava for us. And unfortunately, Char Futur disappeared. Not exactly what we would love to see, but that's what we got. Oh, very hard game. You see, the best performance, in my opinion, with the, most of the tank destroyers is whenever enemy team is stronger than your team is. And then you are kind of carrying the game, right? I think this is the, this is the best um, case scenario for any triangle out there because you are having relatively safe defense parameter and whatnot. You are chilling from uh, the back and enemies are making pressure for you. Since enemies are making pressure for you, you, um, you simply can't spank them. Now, in this kind of situation, we got only 1.5 thousand from enemies making mistakes. And if I hit that blind shot, you know, there is still a big fat if. So this is the thing. Convoy. Oi, oi. Mr. Convoy, love me. Thank you. Thank you very much. I appreciate you, mate. 
And I think all we need to do, we need to make pressure like this. I honestly don't think uh, there is anything else to do about this. I think that it is not a rocket science. We just need to go vroom, 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 and we are okay. We need to go vroom, 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 and we will be okay. Okay, this guy is dead. No, 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 no. One hit points is all I need. One hit points is all I need, fellas. You might think I am feeling bad. You might think I am feeling like uh, I took one for the team. And even though I took one for the team, I still feel great because I'm still alive. How about that? Now, this Centurion might try to peek like this. What is the chance of that? I mean, he is considering of getting involved, I'm telling you. Okay, he's not thinking about this, so now we can now we can try to get involved ourselves. Cobra is sitting near the red line as well. That's understandable. You cannot blame him for this. Convoy is dead, and now we are going to go for Mr. Cobra. The question is, this gentleman is on the reload or not? And you know what? There is only one way how we can check it out and how we can figure this out. Fine. He's not on the reload. Ooh, only 3,000 for a last game. But this is very, very good um, to show those uh, games are happening as well once in a while. If there is no mistakes from the enemy side, uh, it is very hard to get uh, used, right? And once again... After all, we are playing with a triangle, but I'm feeling happy with this session overall. First two games were very, very good. The last game, it was probably below average for sure, but that's what we have. And overall, fellas, object is beautiful. I believe some people could compare object against the Chinese tier 9, but fellas, believe me, this tank is significantly better, at least for me. Armor might look worse on the paper, but it works the same like Chinese one, and it uh, just simply... Works good, in my humble opinion, right? So we have 3,000 damage. We blind shoot at uh, the T-49, which is very, very good. We finish at everything third by experience and fifth by the damage, which is fair and square, you know, hard map. Um, and 8,000 profits. Now, all and all, after our session, yeah, that's great. That's actually awesome. Uh, 3.9 thousand damage average, 300 assisting damage average. This is, this is very, very good. And... Once again, whenever I played with this tank for marks, I played for 3.2400 or 500, right? So I would say this session was better than average. Thank you very much, Object, for entertainment. Mwah. And fellas, I hope you had as much fun as I did because I enjoyed myself to the maximum, honestly. So thank you very much for everything and see you very, very soon. Skill is out for today. Peace.